Today, I am going to demonstrate you how Media Player Classic Black Edition works. MPCB is a free and open source media player and it's a revamped version of MPCSC along with few additional features. So today, I am going to demonstrate you Sigbar with video previewing feature and then will demonstrate you the direct support of Windows Audio Session API. So let's start. Now this is our application. Let's first open any video file. Just go to the file, open file and select your video and OK. Now if you move your cursor over the sick bar, you can see that there is no preview appearing. So to enable the thumbnail preview, just go to the view, go to the option. In the interface, just select an option which is use the preview in the search apply and ok now close your video and reopen your video again and ok now if you move your mouse over the sigbar we can see that the preview is getting generated now sometimes we face an issue where audio output of an application and endpoint device is not in the same flow so to resolve this issue, we use Windows Audio Session API. So to enable this in the Media Player Classic Black Edition, we need to go to the View option. In this, go to the option Audio and here in the Audio Renderer, we need to select MPC Audio Renderer. Now go to the Properties and make sure the mode of the Windows Audio Session API is shared, apply and OK. Now the flow of audio for the application and an end device will be same. And if we face an experience of bad video quality, we can disable the DXV filter. DXVA filter is a direct X video acceleration. It's a Microsoft API specification for the Microsoft Windows platform that allows video decoding to be hardware accelerated. So to disable this, again go to the option. In this, we need to go to the internal filters. Click on video decoder and now right click and disable DXVA filter. Apply and OK. So in this way we can work on Media Player Classic Black Edition. We hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching.